Welcome back. <laughs> hey guys, here for a little tutorial on how to figure eight a bridal. I get this question a lot. I teach at a big lesson barn that we require the students to do figure eights. And I have been noticing people have not been figure eighting their bridles and I'm hoping that it's just a lack of knowledge. So I'm here today to teach you how to figure eight the bridles. So strap in because it's really exciting. It's not exciting at all. But it will make your uh, bridles look so much better and um, I'll show some pictures of what a tack room can look like when the bridles are all nice and neat and tidy. So here we go. First, you're gonna find the throat latch, which is the long leather piece, and you're going to wrap it all the way around the bridle. This is going to create the figure eight look, and it's gonna crisscross in front. If your crisscross happens in back, it's just because you started the wrong way. You wanna start going around the bridle in front. Then you find the other leather piece, you pull the buckle back, and you just slide through the keepers. Now you take your nose band, pull it apart, crisscross it behind, and same thing. Push the buckle back and slide through the keepers. The reason you wanna slide it through the keepers and not buckle it is so that when you go to take it apart, it's really easy to pull apart. So here I'm going to demonstrate taking it apart. So it's super easy just to pull apart when it's just in the keepers as shown and you just wanna pull apart the throat latch and then the nose band like I did here. Just for some variety, I'll do it again. I'm taking the throat latch, I'm taking it out and I'm going to bring it in front first. That's how you're gonna get that nice crisscross of the figure eight in front of the bridle. Wrap it all the way around, find its matching leather piece that it attaches to, push the buckle back and put it through the keepers. I like to put it through both keepers so it gives it a little more hold on the bridle. Now you're gonna take the nose band, crisscross it behind and bring it around in front again, pushing the buckle back and putting it through the keepers. Just like so. And as you can see, it just makes a big tack room just look so much tidier when all the bridles are figurated. Hope you enjoyed this video. Feel free to like and subscribe, and I'll see you at the next one. Bye.